Hello, YouTubers. This is Mabel McGuire, and today you're watching the Swampy Adventures of Ike with Mike. Hey, YouTubers. It's beautiful out here today. It's a nice foggy. Oh, there goes a deer in the distance, if you can see it. Nice foggy morning. There was just a covey of bobwhite quail that just exploded up into the sky when I got up on top of this hill here. But it's, it's nice and serene. Gonna enjoy a short hike. No uh, swamp hiking today because my swamp shoes are still drying out, so it'll be a dry hike. But that's all right. It's just another day in the woods and it's always a good day. Hey YouTubers. Hike with Mike here, of course. Another swamp talk. But instead of philosophy, it's more practicality. A lot of preserves, car camping places, even some primitive camps you hike to will have this style of um, a fire ring with a, a grill ring, or not a grill ring, but a, a grill available. But I would never cook over this here. You'd, I have seen the most disgusting, most toxic stuff thrown in these um, campfires. Uh, plastics, metals, and everything else, and then you flip that over and cook on here over this ring, it's not going to be very healthy. There's a lot of toxic uh, stuff that people throw in here. Cigarette butts and everything else. That just It's a stew of toxicity. So, this is just a, a warning, I guess. Is And I've done it before. I've cooked over these, you know, but I started thinking about all the stuff that's thrown in here over the years, seeing some of the stuff, some nasty stuff that's been thrown in the um, campfires. Um, you can see here there's some aluminum foil that'll just be burning and who knows what type of fumes that's going to um, emit onto your food. So I would highly recommend not using these grills that are over campfires because the quality and the health hazards are not worth it. And also a lot of times, particularly in the south, we have a lot of softwoods, pines and cedars. And there's a lot of resins in that. And if you use that to cook over, that's not healthy either. So a lot of places do have the fire ring. I just wish they would get rid of the grills because that kind of just promotes people wanting to cook over this. They should just have a ring. And then they also have here, a lot of places have started to have a separate um, grill here where you can cook more safely and control the toxicity <laughs> and things like that. So this is more of just a... A warning you know about using the fire ring um, grills that are on here it's just not worth it health wise um, if I was doing some uh, primitive camping and I came across a fire ring like this uh, I would just have my own stove and cook on my own stove that I brought in and if you're car camping and that's all they have to offer there is bring your own grill but definitely don't cook over these fire rings because you don't know what people are throwing in there it's not worth risking your health and that's today's swamp talk hope you enjoyed another cool thing about today in the mail I got a new sticker from Handy Camper he left me a little note here thanks so much for the sticker and support I'd send him one you make great vids that I enjoy stay safe out there in the swamp and stay tuned for the next one as always next videos and his uh, signature phrase is plan, prepare, and practice. Great channel. He's in North Carolina, one of my favorite places to visit. Love the mountains up there and the waterfalls. And um, he's um, a frequent uh, guest on a lot of live streams. And he always has uh, great comments and things like that. And it's always very positive. So go check out Handy Camper. Another cool sticker to add to my hiking gear cabinet. Great channels. Good stuff.